Hello everyone, I'm Tom with Stock Navigator. Today I'm going to show you five stocks to buy at a discount price right now. Uh, first of all, uh, remember we are not your financial advisor or investment uh, consultant. Uh, everything we do here is just for the education purpose only. So before you take a trade, you need to consult with your financial advisor. Okay, so um, uh, let's get started. Uh, as you know, in the year of 2022, the SB 500 they finished the year down more than 20%. So now, the, you remember the market, it, it cannot go up forever, cannot go down forever. The downturn in the market will reveal some opportunity for you if you know where to looking for. So there are some good company with a stock price at a discount right now. So are we, we're going to go to detail on the check later. So watch this video to the end so you can see the five best stocks to buy right now. Okay, so first of all, before we start, uh, to uh, looking for the strong stock to buy, we have to take a look on the major indices to see which one is the strongest one right now. Uh, so if you look at 11 sector at the 500 right now, we look at for the material sector, the XLP, to be able to uh, turn around and put it back up to the upside. Uh, the um, uh, uh, industrial, they also uh, try to find a way to break out this level and the technology after they pull back, now they are find a way to put it back up also. The energy have to pull back down but they still hold uh, very strong now they are looking forward to move higher. The XLC is a, a, um, a communication, it also turned around a couple uh, lacking behind like uh, healthcare, biotech, uh, they are uh, have a dip down but now they try to looking for short term bow also. So um, financial it also try to uh, looking to put it back up even even though they are not strong like uh, the material, the industrial, uh, technology and energy and the communication. So we'll, we'll focus on those sectors looking for the five best stocks that we can buy. Okay? Um, so if you like those kind of video that we uh, posted here Please subscribe and we will notify every time the, we have a new lesson for you. Okay, so now let's um, uh, look at to the chart right now. As you can see, uh, uh, all the sector there uh, try to find a way to break out, as you can see here. So, if everything be able to break out next week, and then we have a chance for the market to, to put it back up. Now, let's take a look on the um, uh, five top, uh, the number one. Uh, that we're looking at, let's say the energy sector. Um, let's let's say before we get into the detail, let's take a look on the FB 500 to see where we are. So if you look at the the longer term chart of the FB 500, you can see that the this chart, uh, the, you can see that they hold up very well at the 200 day moon, 200 week moon average. Every time they go down, they put it back up. They go down. They put back up on the COVID-19. They put it down a little bit deeper, but they are quickly about back up and continue to the upside. So after they run up for a while, uh, the market has pulled back down since the beginning of 2021 to the end of 2022. And then uh, one more time, they follow support. Now they find a way to put it up to the upside. So as you can see, they put it back up right to resistance. They pull back down. They be able to break out. Now they come back retail. If retail here at all, the market will continue to find a way to put it up to the upside. How far they will go, we don't know. But in the short term, the market looking for stabilization and then find a way to put it back up. And then we will analyze uh, the market, you know, uh, day by day, month by month to see where they're heading to. But in the short term, the market is trying to find a support when they pull back down here. And basically on the activity on uh, Friday, you can see that the market is be able to uh, file some strong support and bow back up on Thursday and Friday, as you can see here. So on the way up, we have some uh, resistance this level and this level to see it, uh, how high they can get there. Now let's take a look on the first sector, the, um, the, uh, the communication. The communication is the worst sector that they have a worst performance in the year 2022. So now they are the one that try to turn around. So uh, we looking for uh, the first stock, they call a meta, which is the old fable. As you can see that after they, uh, they have a bad performance, 
uh, until the end of year 2022, and then they turn around, the market be able to put it back up, and then they run back up, they pull back down. Now they be able to build the route bay, okay, sort of, if, if this one here is continue to put it back up, this market to continue to put another lap up to the upside. So the first stop is META, M-E-T-A. So you should uh, put in your watch list, see where to go. The uh, stock number two, which is uh, the energy sector. Uh, uh, let me pick one stock, let's say USO, okay, that's the uh, uh, United Oil. As you can see, this stock has been uh, uh, hit, they, they run up when the uh, market is uh, going down. The oil stock has uh, it outperformed, it should it back up, and after that, they do a sideways correction here. However, in the last, um, uh, since the beginning of the year until now, they're able to build a bay. They still uh, make a uh, high low every single time. So on a Friday, they'll be able to break out. So in the short term, you can see that the oil stock is uh, try to put it back up. So the one we pick up is the USO. So this one is ready to break out. And then we have a, a move back up to the upside. Um, the next one is the XLK, which is a technology. As you can see, that the interest rate they cooled out a little bit on Friday. So after the Fed, they have a good comment on the interest rate, and the technology stock be able to put it back up. Uh, let me. There's a lot of uh, the good technology stocks, especially semiconductor, they are still doing very well. Uh, like Nvidia, they have been a very strong while back up. So now we're looking for a share and drown of the stock that I do consider a cheap price and then buy back up. So I'm going to pick up the AMAC with the Applied Material. Applied Material, you can see that uh, it's beginning with, you know, last year they put it back up and they pull back down. And then they put one hour back up and pull back down. But in the last couple of days, they be able to file away here. We have a lot of volume coming in. So uh, if they continue with the high low, high high pattern here, this stock it do continue have a room, a lot of room to the upside right there. And the uh, uh, material XLB is also doing well. So let me pick up one stock there, AMR, which is a core stock. This stock has been uh, 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 very strong. They uh, continue to make it a uh, high low every single time. So they test the sales on a couple of times, they fail to break it. But in the last uh, couple of days, there's more momentum shift to the upside and seem like they are trying to find a way to break out here. And uh, this is one of the strong talk in the uh, 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 material sector right there. Okay. Uh, and the um, next one, I'm going to pick up one talk of the XLV, which is the healthcare and biotech. Healthcare and biotech, like I showed you earlier, they are. Uh, 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 after they run back up, they are a strong uh, 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 defense stock when the market, it, uh, the SP find that it, it came in down. But uh, there are some stock that they start, uh, they still hold very strong and then they are very cheap price. And let me pick up one of them at the uh, I, ILMN. Okay. So this stock is the uh, Aluminia, they are biotech company in San Diego. So they have been. Uh, hold up pretty well to the buy on they test a couple of times and the last two days they be able to put it back up so look like it, more buyer coming in more momentum here so they stay about the 200 day moon average so momentum is shipped back up if we can clear this area here this stuff is trying to find a way to go higher so they still have a lot of room now that's a, a good discount uh, to put it back up so I think it that a um, uh, uh, five top that uh, we have right now. So uh, if you um, uh, would like to learn and understand how to analyze the chart and how to use the technical analysis to analyze the chart correctly, you can check out our website at topnavigator.com because without a right education, the top market can be a dangerous place for you to be. So uh, the expert trader court we offer by Top Navigator will teach you the right location to fit your trading objective and to be a successful trader or investor. And we also have live 24 hour community. Uh, they can support for learning and trading and share ideas 24 hours a day. And not just teaching you, but we will help you to mentor you 
on uh, 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 everyday mentoring section so that you can review and understand the code material and you can see where the market is heading to. And we have a day uh, live trading room that where uh, myself and a couple more instructors, we do live trade to show you where the market is heading to. And at Talk Navigator, we train, we mentor, and empower our students to operate 100% independently so that you can navigate the market with the confidence. So take the next step forward to taking control of your financial future. So you can check out our web, uh, you can watch the free webinar following the link uh, right below. Okay, so uh, thank you for watching and uh, uh, I will see you in the next video. Take care everyone.